Following Evan Rachel Wood's allegations, Game of Thrones actress Esme Bianco is the latest woman to accuse rock artist Marilyn Manson of abuse. Esme speaks out in a new interview with ABC News. I was defrauded. I was transported from the UK to the US. I was harbored and then I was coerced into involuntary servitude and in which included sexual abuse and physical abuse. In a statement to ABC News, Bianco's lawyer says his client was interviewed by FBI agents in Los Angeles last week at their request. Bianco says she also turned over evidence of alleged abuses by Manson, specifically relating to human trafficking and sex crimes. ABC News adds the FBI would not confirm or deny if there is an active investigation into Manson. Just over a week after another Manson ex, Evan Rachel Wood, publicly named the singer as her alleged abuser, Bianco spoke out in an interview with The Cut. In the article, Esme claimed the rocker, whose real name is Brian Hugh Warner, physically abused her during their 2011 relationship. Bianco previously made her allegations in testimony to the California State Assembly, but at the time did not name her alleged abuser. E! News has reached out to Manson for comment, but have not heard back. In her ABC News interview, Esme claims the abuse first took place on the set of a 2009 music video shot at Manson's home. It got to the stage where he wanted to shoot the finale of the video, and he locked me in his bedroom, and he tied me to a wooden pranilla. I was half naked, and he beat me with a whip. Following the shoot, Bianco claims they began a sexual relationship. In 2011, Manson's abuse allegedly escalated. She says that he decided what she wore, when she slept, and whether she could leave his West Hollywood apartment. One day, she alleges things reached a tipping point. He thought I had put cockroaches in the walls to mess with him. And he took an ax and he started smashing holes in the walls. And then he started chasing me with the ax. And at that point, I thought he's gonna kill me. Amid the allegations, his record label made a statement announcing it was dropping him. Following Evan Rachel Wood's claims, Manson shared a statement to social media denying the allegations, saying, Obviously, my art and life have long been magnets for controversy, but these recent claims about me are horrible distortions of reality. My intimate relationships have always been entirely consensual with like-minded partners. Regardless of how and why others are now choosing to misrepresent the past, that is the truth. Manson has not publicly commented on Bianco's claims.